Dr. King's favorite patient. He's hilarious. Old school comedian. I've loved him since I was a kid. I did one of his routines word for word in my fourth grade talent show. Uh, it did not go well. But in my defense, I thought he actually went motorboating with Charo. <laughs> Tiki! How's my favorite pint-sized doc? Huh? Look at this guy. He's so small, he can model for trophies. <laughs> oh, I am not tall. <laughs> clacky, clacky. If that dome gets any shiny, you can get a job as a lighthouse. <laughs> Demona, Demona, you look younger every year. Oh. And again, I'm legally blind, so you do the math. <laughs> Whoa, 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 who, who, who is this? Hi, Dickie, I'm Dr. Julie Dobbs. What do you say we go down to the courthouse and change your name to wife number five? <laughs> oh, hey, 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 listen. I got this for you. My show at the Tropicana, 1978. Thanks, Dickie. I listen to these whenever I'm in a bad mood. So always? <laughs> People, a lot of you are late with your time cards this week. Whoa, so whoa, we're... whoa. Where'd you get this guy? Bureaucrats are us? Okay. <laughs> okay, Dickie. Let's get you to an exam room. Seriously, if red tape and boredom had a kid, it would be that guy. 